So let's try this again. Got a little bit more elaborate setup this time. I've got a degree wheel on the output and still have my vice grips on the input. Um, this box is actually um, a Cardone 276530, which is not supposed to be the um, the high ratio, or I'm sorry, the close ratio um, high effort box. It's not the sport box, or you know, different people uh, have it listed differently. But surprisingly, this actually appears to be a close ratio box, but it's got the wrong stops in it. So, at least for an F body. Um, I've got it set up here, and I know I'm going to have problems with the center detent on this one. This one's a lot stiffer than the other boxes. Um, the center detent is actually off a couple degrees to the left, but um, let's see if we can do this. Um, right now, I've got this centered. Um, I have actually already tried this, so I actually know what we're going to see. But um, cranked all the way over, the F body boxes are supposed to have somewhere around 62, I think it's 62 degrees. Um, 62 degrees travel, somewhere in that range. I know it's under 70. I think I think it's supposed to be 70 degrees if you had 15 inch wheels and like 60. I'm sorry, I don't think it was 62. I think it's 67 degrees. Either way, it's somewhere in the 60s. That said, this one from center to one side. Now, when I touch it, it does move around a little bit, but it always settles to the same place. So. Let's see if I can do this one-handed. There we go, we're past the center detent. So, in one direction, we get a little over, a little over a turn and a half, slightly over, and we have forty-four and a half degrees. Looks like forty-four and a half degrees from here, where I was lined up. Um, going the other way, we'll get 44 and a half degrees the other way also. So, um, this has, no, I'm sorry, 43 and a half degrees. This has, um, almost 90 degrees travel, which is way too much for an F body. But if you do the math, you have around, I used, um, somewhere between 3.05 and 3.1 turns and that's pretty accurate actually and um, 87 degrees travel and I get 12.6 something I believe it's uh, I get between 12.62 and 12.7 something um, ratio which is actually the fast ratio box so what do I do with that? <laughs> Nudged it a little bit. There we go. Let's see if I can get this thing to center up and go past. Sorry about that. This might end up a worse video than the other one, even though I spent more time setting things up. I 
so I know I nudged that a little bit. But again, just short of 45 degrees, and again, we got a little bit more than a turn and a half on there. Which ends up being a 12.7 to 1 box. In a box that's not supposed to be a close ratio box. As best I can figure what the rebuilders are, are doing, or the rebuilder, this is a Cardone box, but like all the rest of them, it has this little 3F label on it. I don't know if you can see it there. Yeah. So it's not focused. So the Cardone boxes, the AutoZone Airlast boxes, um, the Napa boxes all have those labels on them. Um, and they all come out of a white cardboard box that looks like that. And then, like, this is a Cardone one, which, interestingly, actually has an OEM label on it. So what I, I don't think I finished saying what I was saying. Um, what I think the rebuilder is actually doing is whatever they get returned as a core, they rebuild it and throw it back in the box. Or a box labeled the same thing. Because this obviously doesn't have F-body stops in it and this should not be a close ratio box according to the part number, but um, it's being sold as a, um, a non-close ratio F-body box.